So I just passed through the security check and I'm in the airport in Floripa. It's pretty small, but it's a new looking airport, as you can see around. And it's, it's not very busy, so I don't think there's a lot of people traveling in here. I am flying with Azul today to Porto Alegre. So I don't know how busy the flight is. I don't know what to expect in Porto Alegre, but it's gonna be something new for sure. Yeah, this is starting to get filled up here. Pizza Hut, holy crap. <laughs> I'm probably gonna get something to eat too. I hadn't had breakfast or lunch yet. Before I do that, there's the view from the airport. This seems to be the only choice. It's even smaller airport than uh, than Santos Dumont. I'm just gonna get something basic. All right, so it's about an hour, hour or so flight. I think it's like 45 minutes actually. It's even closer than the distance between Sao Paulo and Rio. It's uh, yeah, about 45 minutes, 50 minutes. So, I, I, last flight I had to get here had quite a bit of turbulence, uh, and my ear was uh, like full of pressure. It was bad. I hope that doesn't happen this time because it's damn painful. So, when the food get when I get the food, I'll show you guys what it is. It's probably gonna be good. So we'll see. Okay, so the food has arrived. Looks pretty good. Uh, the total cost for everything here was about 58 reais. Uh, this is a small fries. I'm trying to eat healthier, but there's not much choice when you go to the airport. So, yeah, we'll see how this, how good this is. I'll let you know when, my, when I'm heading towards the gate after. Let's give it a whirl, guys. Yeah, it's really good. It tastes like a real burger, not like McDonald's or whatever. So. Very, very good. Oh, after the bank. Session 3. Obrigado, tá? Tchau, tchau. Boa tarde. Olá, tudo bem? Tudo bem, você está bem? Boa tarde.
Let's take a look at this airport. So this flight was about 40 minutes, so it was pretty quick, actually. Not bad. I like the short flights. <laughs> so I'm going to head to my Airbnb, show you guys the Airbnb. Maybe I'm going to go out tonight, I don't know. We'll see. Let's check it out. Curious to see what people are like here too. There's the exit. <laughs> Always a Starbucks. Great. <laughs> the outside. Not as cold as I thought it would be. I don't know where to get an Uber here. Ah, uh, particular I guess that over there. I don't know. Ah, okay. Now I see the Uber. So when you leave the airport, you gotta they they give the priority to cabs. So Uber's just sort of on the opposite side of the street, almost like in the middle, I should say. It's much like uh, Toronto. Very much like. Let's hope I don't get hit by a car. Right? Yeah. <laughs> What can I get in, guys? Okay, you get up. Okay, you get up. It's all facial recognition. <laughs> like a... Okay, you get up. That's crazy. Okay, you get up. Bye -bye. Recreation area. That's crazy, man. It's a nice place. Let's check out the room. So the door locks automatically. It's got a barbecue there. I don't know where the rest of it is. Probably won't do a barbecue in here. Nice bed, couch, place to put all your shit. Not bad. I'm gonna head out, maybe show a little bit of a, around the area. Heading out on the street, guys. Apparently, there's a movement out or down downtown. Let's check it out. I'm gonna run <laughs> or get hit by a bus. I can make a comparable analysis to Rio. It's much like downtown Rio, so we'll see how this goes. I'm sure it's not extremely dangerous. Tomorrow is a holiday, so. <laughs> Go. Go. Não estou gravando a tua cara, não se preocupe. He's like, oh, you're recording. I'm like, yes, not your face. I don't know if you can see me, but it's uh, like two blocks from where I'm staying. It's very dodgy. <laughs> so I'm going to walk quickly and get to where it seems to be more movement. And I'll definitely take an Uber back home, so 
Yeah, welcome to the adventure, Porto Alegre. So I just asked the cop and he's like, I wouldn't go there if I were you. Because <laughs> you saw me with the camera and then I have the satchel here like with my phone and whatnot. So he's like, I wouldn't, yeah, it's a little bit, it's a little bit dangerous. So well, I live in Rio, so whatever. Let's go see what happens. I mean, it, any worst case scenario, I'll fucking run and, or I'll bash him with the camera, whatever. <laughs> Got across here and then he said, keep going left to get to downtown. I don't imagine it being sketchier than than downtown Rio, but I mean, it's nighttime, so it could be pretty fucked up. Kind of reminds me of Rio here in the city, the way it's uh, the layout. Don't do this at home, guys. I am a professional. <laughs> I think the problem is the camera. So when I get to downtown, I'll uh, continue filming. Welcome to Porto Alegre, one of Brazil's, I guess, most dangerous cities, especially in the south, probably the most dangerous. Walking on some random street downtown, Porto Alegre. It's probably not the best idea I've had so far. Granted, I don't even know how good the quality of the video is going to be because it's pretty dark here, but we'll get something. Way different vibe here. It's a cross between <laughs> Rio and Sao Paulo, I guess. I'm not gonna stick around down here too long because I think everything's closing. But it looks, uh, yeah, pretty pretty abysmal when it comes to this city. I think everything's closing. Amigo, license Tudo bem? Onde fica o mais centro que tem mais movimento dessa hora? Mais para lá ou para lá? Direto? Obrigadão. Ah, so I asked them where, which area has the most movement at this time? And they said straight, just go straight. Well, I said straight, and he said yes. I think you just have to be, you know, I have my Rio mentality on right now. <laughs> Living in Rio for so long, you have to just, it's hard because I was so relaxed for the last week or so. Yeah, I, I think because it's since the, uh, tomorrow's a holiday, a national holiday, um, things are just shutting down a little bit earlier. From someone, the, the Uber driver told me that it uh, everything generally closes by seven, eight, eight o'clock anyway. But to go to it's a nice park, but to go to Cidad uh, Baixa, I don't know how far that is from here, but I'm. Probably not going to walk the whole way. Let's see what's down this street. Shit, I think I stepped in something. No. <laughs> it's my imagination. Yeah, I think everything looks shut.
and it's very poorly lit here. I don't know if you guys, I guess you guys can tell that. Very poorly lit. No street lights around here. And it's not as cold as I thought, like I mentioned. So Naps telling you to go this way. Apparently it's busy this way. Maybe everybody's going home. Looks like they're doing renovations here or street work. I see flashing sirens, so that <laughs> I guess that's where they have to put they put where the most movement goes, you know, with the police. So I'm not going to stay out here much longer. I'm gonna head back. If I can find something to eat here, I'm gonna I'm gonna get something to eat, but this is this must be the main street that I saw in one of the videos. Um, a lot of the a lot of these stores will probably be closed tomorrow, and then I'm gonna we'll have to wait until today's Wednesday, so I'll have to wait till Friday to to really get a read of how busy it gets in downtown Porto Alegre. But this is very reminiscent of Rio. I know I say that a lot, but it's it is true. I think Porto Alegre is like about 250 years old, or maybe a bit more. Why, why is it so dim here? Like, this is crazy. There's no lighting. If I had got here about an hour earlier, um, probably would have saw a bit more action. But we'll, we'll go straight and then I'll, I'll see if I can find some uh, some food. Very interesting looking city though. But where the hell is all the light? <laughs> I, 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 I know I'm sounding like a broken record, but like, show me where there's a lot of light here. You're probably not even gonna see me that well. There's no damn light in here. Boa noite, tudo bem? Tem um restaurante por aqui que ainda está aberto. O quê? Um restaurante com comida típica daqui. É o primeiro dia para mim aqui. Mercado no público. Aonde fica o mercado público? Estou descendo lá. o reto. O prédio amarelo lá. Uh -huh. Tá vendo aqui? Ó, sim, sim. Com reta. as luzes, né? Isso. Desce na lateral. Ah, Aí tá. tem restaurante. Ainda está aberto, né? Tá aberto. Obrigadão. Cool. Alright, so we're gonna head this way. Mercado Público. Ah, this, this, <laughs> this sidewalk part looks sketchy as fuck. Just, I don't get it. The lighting. A lot of stuff is in uh, in construction over here. The streets. Oh wow! Okay, I see like a an old. It looks like it's probably the the city hall of the, of the city.
This looks like the main, like the real downtown of Porto Alegre. Oh, sweet. Well, I will do an in-depth, uh, an in-depth walk around uh, here. I don't know about tomorrow, I'll see because it's a holiday, so I'll, I'll check where it's most movement. But it's definitely pretty cool here. Blue Bang. The guy was staring at me. Mercado Pulu. Could go over there. I think it's close. Cafe show? That cafe show? Okay. Só a praça de alimentação. Ah, praça de alimentação é isso que eu quero. Uh -huh. Tem restaurantes aqui, no entorno, ali no próximo corredor. Sim. E seguindo a linha amarela, só a escada rolante, tem uns restaurantes ali em cima também. Show. Obrigado. Nada só. Ah, ok. This is much like the one in uh, in Floripa, actually, but much bigger, much much bigger. And it, does, it appears to have stores and like a, an actual market. They sell stuff here. It's not just food. Closes at 10. Just to take a look at the square, and then I'm gonna head back, and I'll end the video. 
Celsius, so it's a bit on the low side. I, I think the pharmacy might have one, so I'm gonna check over there. This looks like some sort of bus station. It's becoming more abandoned here. The later it goes. Well, I got water and uh, I'm gonna head home because I'm beat. I just want to see what this place is first. Perfect time to end the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. It was uh, a little rough around the edges down here. Um, more content from Porto Alegre to come. So far, so good. I mean, it's what I kind of expected in this city. So, uh, we'll see. A few more days left here. And we'll uh, check out many more uh, tourist attractions <laughs> and the people. Good night from Porto Alegre.